Hey guys, what's going on? Back with another video. As you can see, it's going to be something totally different than I normally do. Uh, for this one, I'm going to talk about the theory or idea that uh, Elsa and Anna's parents are dead. They died in a shipwreck um, when they were leaving uh, to go to a ceremony of sorts. I'm not going to go too much into the backstory or even theories. Just going to show a quick solve, stuff that people have missed. And it's not going to be an ad, but just to let you know, this is stuff that I do for Call of Duty all the time where... Uh, a lot of their stories, especially the zombies, black ops zombie stories, they all intertwine and have all these secret e easter eggs and you have to look really deeply and closely uh, to find some of the easter eggs and there's so many different layers of uh, storytelling. Um, again, if you're not familiar, uh, Call of Duty has a zombies mode and for the last about 12 years, uh, there's a really long storyline that's been going ever since like 2008-2009 all the stories intertwined so that's kind of my credentials or resume so to speak i do this um in our zombies community we call it and you kind of look for easter egg stuff that people haven't solved over the years and this is kind of similar to that so as you probably know there's a scene where anna's parents are at sea and we did find out some stuff in frozen too but i'm again not going to dive too much into the backstory i usually and like i said for call of duty zombies i just show the solve I don't get involved in too much like what could that mean, what does this mean. I just kind of show the solve stuff that people have missed. And this uh, movie came out in 2013. So this is something that I believe went undiscovered because I searched on YouTube and Google. Didn't find anybody noticing this um, until, um, until when I started looking into it. I really honestly, which is going to be like a huge shocked a lot of people i just first saw this movie maybe a month ago uh maybe even less of that from disney plus so i'm still kind of looking at some of the lore that's in frozen and all the easter eggs among all the different uh disney movies and pixar movies uh live action or cartoon animated uh there's so many intertwining stories and crossovers uh, so in this scene, you'll see that the ship is at sea and it's gonna, getting battered by the ocean. Might be tying into Triton and Atlantis and stuff like that. Again, I'm not going to dive too much into it. But if you didn't notice it then, uh, I'm just going to backtrack. You're going to probably notice it now how... Um, and this is zoomed in, so it might be a little bit easier to spot it because normally this is zoomed out a lot. Uh, so as you can see, I'm going to pause it and this is something that people miss. You can actually see the rowboat here because there is a story again uh, or theory and it might have been that he spilled the beans by accident that um, Elsa's parents ended up uh, getting sh uh, ship, not shipwrecked, but ended up rowing to a jungle in South America ends up being uh, Tarzan's parents uh, and the parents of them eventually die I think a, a leopard cougar kills them in the beginning of Tarzan but as you can see there's a rowboat that's rowing there and it's something that people missed um, throughout the years I don't see that anybody has ever noticed this I did maybe come across one photo on um, whoops Google images but that website might be a little bit corrupted so I wouldn't necessarily go searching for that um clip uh image because that's the only thing i've seen on the internet as far as anybody spotting the actual rowboat in their first movie because right here you can see the rowboat if you zoomed in i'm telling you right now you can like oh that's so obvious but it's not because i'm i'm zoomed in a lot i took it from uh, a cell phone camera so this is gonna be really easy to spot because it's zoomed in a lot um so again you can see the rowboat rowing uh to safety and it's something like i said i do this kind of stuff for call of duty black ops zombies and there's a lot of stuff in the last 12 years for them that people have missed uh so this is kind of similar where disney and stuff hides uh well not really disney but developers and creators they hide easter eggs in their movies and games so clever that people won't ever notice it and again this came out in maybe like nine years ago uh, but again you can see the actual robo uh, there is one of the riders again like i said that spilled the beans that might have uh let people known about this 
probably before Disney wanted to let people know. So I'm sure he got reprimanded and he had to kind of backtrack and he reworded what he said. Uh, again, he ended up saying that it was his imagination, but I think he kind of spilled the beans. And it happens in every industry. It does happen in actually the Call of Duty industry also. A lot of stuff uh, leaks or it, somebody spills the beans uh, and they end up getting reprimanded. But you can see the rowboat and the idea is that they end up rowing to um the the island where tarzan takes place uh now i'm probably i don't like doing theories or ideas i just show the solve but it wouldn't surprise me if now disney has to change that story because if they go with the tarzan story they're probably you know nobody's gonna really really be interested uh so i think they're probably gonna have to like flip the switch or flip the script and do something different something that people haven't known about yet because if they end up just making it tied into tarzan um you know nobody's gonna really be interested they're probably gonna do something totally different uh the only other last piece of um thing that i want to show you guys is um on the internet guardian images posted a video and it's from uh, a tv show on disney called once upon a time it actually shows the the shipwreck it uh i don't think it shows maybe them rowing anywhere uh it's a tv show i'm sure it has a lot of episodes uh so there might be some other um angle that they end up using i don't know what the show shows that happens if they end up tying it into the tarzan lore or universe or they end up going a different angle but there is a video if you want to check it out um and it shows anna and elsa's parents getting shipwrecked and the the shipwreck actually happening and they put a message in a bottle um but i don't i haven't watched the show don't know too much about it i don't know if they end up rowing to safety to an island and um the only thing is in this and that might be why disney might even debunk their own idea is i don't know if she's pregnant in here or it could be that maybe they thought they're gonna get wrecked and then maybe a couple months later something happens and she gets pregnant because in this one um i don't believe she's pregnant or the could be some type of magic where they end up putting curse on her and maybe somehow the people of atlantis or uh, i forget the name of it in frozen 2 maybe they put a spell on her give her um a baby that she didn't want maybe a cursed baby i don't know it could be some magic involved uh because i don't know necessarily if she's pregnant here or how she's going to get pregnant or nine months pregnant within um that short amount of time so they're probably going to intertwine some magic in there maybe a curse of some kind um maybe like i don't know the timeline there was a crazy timeline maybe like quasimodo or something maybe that's the cursed child or something maybe they're going to intertwine it like that i i don't know exactly um but that would be interesting to see how they kind of give us the answer of how she got pregnant um but again, I just wanted to kind of point out the main idea is just to show you guys that uh, they do show the robo. A lot of people probably missed it over the last couple of years, uh, but it is something very interesting that people probably missed. You'll see the robo again right there. Uh, anyways, I'll see you guys later. Let me know what you think.